<coughs> so you ready to have? Mm -hmm. So uh, the reason why we're not allowed to have meat during this period of time is uh, due to the Chorban Beit the Migdash and the Klal Yisrael is in a, in a state of Avelut over the loss of the Beit the Migdash. But the Avelut really is not just over a, a building, over stones in a courtyard. It's over a relationship that Klal Yisrael had with one another and when with Hashem when that institution was uh, founded. And so we know that the, the base of Mikdash was destroyed because of an Indian, because of Sinat Sinam. The Jews had baseless hatred towards one another. They didn't care about one another to a deep enough, uh, in a deep enough way. They didn't appreciate one another. They didn't feel related to one another enough that uh, it was enough to cause the Rabbi Nishon to take the base of Mikdash. It's also a concept brought down in the Gemara and Gemara Shavuot, Lama Tesan and Aleph, of Harei Atam Harein Zeh Bozeh, that the Klal Yisrael has a real relationship with one another. How far? The relationship is such that we don't say hare atem arevim ze lo ze. That's normal ha ivrit for having a relationship. That one has a relationship to another person. We say hare atem arevim ze bo ze. You are in that other person. A Jew, it's like it's a chalik of yourself. So, when I was young, er, <laughs> Uh, from the age of 17 to like 18, 17 and a half to 18 and a half. Yeah, Baruch Hashem. I had the great schut of taking like a, uh, a gap 10 months between high school. I lived in Eretz Yisrael and uh, going into the Israeli Navy, into a uh, special forces unit in the Israeli Navy. <coughs> and in that gap year, we lived on a farm and I had the tremendous schut of working up in the chicken coops with my father. And my father had a friend named Tuvia. And I wound up that year, Tuvia and I, he became a huge mashpia on me. We had a chavruta. We learned an hour to three hours a day together. And he really... Without a doubt, I could be moide that, that my chavrusa with him and my yedidus with him was really the foundation <coughs> of my spiritual adulthood. He put me kind of, he put me on a path. And I was always indebted to him, although I came from the from family, whatever it was, I was always indebted to this Pasha to Yid. He wasn't my Rebbe, he wasn't my Rav, he wasn't my parent, who was nice in this, he was my spear. Twenty-four years ago, that mashpia Tuvia, he walked into a base medrash where I was the uh, mashpia. I hadn't seen him in a decade, and he told me, I don't know how he found me there, and he told me that I owed him. He knew the toys that he'd done in my life and that I owed him. And he said that he had a special present for me that I had to take a Christ for. And he took me, we met in Brooklyn, and he introduced me to an 18-year-old Yaakov Abadi. And he told me, I want you to take a Christ for this young man. He does not have much and he could use a mentor, he could use help, direction. And that was the beginning of a beautiful relationship that not one dollar flowed from me to him. It was never that kind of help, 
But the relationship was built on hare atem hare vizet vizet. And when I look at a seum of this nature, I think this is four generations of hashpah. Look what one yid can do from not his rov, not his kavrusa, not his father, not his rebbe in yeshiva, a poshit yid. When you give a little bit of care one yid for another, you can have four generations of care of So from my perspective, this scene, the Rabbani Shem should be Mashiach right now. If Sinas Chinam took away the base of Mikdash, then mom is right here for me personally. There's aha the skin. There's no reason I what why am I this? We shouldn't even know each other. We should be strangers passing each other on the street. No shaykhis bikla. And it's only because of Vaidis Hashem and Ahabas Per and Ahabas Hashem that we have a relationship that I've been managed by every simcha you've made in life. I make it. And the Rabbanish should just bench you and Yitzhak. That you should, you know what, one day have the same horn that I have sitting here knowing that you were my fear. Amen. 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 Amen.